Gimme a head with hair, long beautiful hair, shining, gleaming. The leaves change, the temperatures change, and maybe your hair color should change with the season. Blaine with Blaine's Color is here with some of the hottest colors. Hello, Blaine. Good morning. What a fun week. This has I'm been fun. Really fun. Hair, you know, we always kind of get it wrong once we leave the salon. We want to maintain all that great color that we paid so much for. We also want to try to style our hair at home sometimes, too. But you're here for the hot colors. Yes, ma'am. What are we seeing for fall and for the winter? We're seeing lots of deep golds, reds, lots of deep reds. Fun. Yeah. For some reason, reds are just coming on really strong right okay. now. Okay. Do you think I could be a redhead someday, yeah, Blaine? We talk about this every time. Every we year. Need to do it. You know we I'm just chicken. Need to do it. I'm addicted to my bleach. I can't go red. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see some girls that did add the reds to their hair. What are we seeing first? This is Saffron Surprise. This is Brenna. She um, came in. Uh, her hair had been a lot, very faded from the summer sun and everything. So what we did was we went through and just put a nice saffron, coppery red in it. Yeah. Real, she, very intense okay, color. Okay, so what, can I ask what her natural color is? Is it, does she have red in her it's hair? It's a medium brown. It's a medium brown. Uh -huh. And she looks totally natural. Like, this looks like she's a redhead. It, it's, yeah, with her green eyes, it's, she's, she's made to be a redhead. Can you turn around so I can see, like, the whole effect of the back? Wow, this looks really natural. So a lot of medium browns can do this. Uh -huh. Absolutely, it's a great look. It's like a single process. What is this like? Actually, it's a 10-minute color. It's a new color that it just came out November 1st. I've been working with for a few months. And it's 10 minutes you're in and out. The what? color stays on your hair. 10 minutes 10 in minute. and out? No more 30-minute processing times. No more 45-minute processing times. Yeah. And 10 then, minutes processing And time. then to maintain this great luck, you would come in, what, like once every... With red, you're going to do it a little more often because red's temp the hair color molecule is bigger. Sure. So it tends to fade. Right. So probably Maybe about every five weeks. Oh, that's it. That's good. Yeah. Once a month, every five weeks, you can maintain that, especially if it's just 10 minutes. That's right. Well, thank you, Sassy. You look awesome. Let's go to our next model. What color is she demonstrating this today? This is Cinnamon Twist. And when the lights hit this, you're going to see all this deep, deep cinnamon. And then what we did was we took and put we put in some really deep, dark chocolate highlights in it. Yeah. And just give it a little more pop. So you give it more dimension. So you kind of add the depth so uh -huh. that those cinnamon pieces show uh -huh. up. And, and it just pulls out that 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 lighter, more intense copper red. But that then that that black kind of sets it off. Yeah. Okay. So is this another 10-minute process? Absolutely. All all, for, all three of my models today are 10-minute hair colors. Oh, pretty. Snazzy. Lunchtime hair color. That's right. Lunchtime. Hair Color. We like it. I love those pops of cinnamon. I think for someone who didn't want to overcommit with the color, just wanted to experiment. That's right. This would be a good step one. Right, and you can see the, the, the dark pieces through there. So that's what kind of gives it that nice undertone. Yep, I like it a lot. You look awesome. Thank you so much, little cinnamon twist. Let's go to our third model. <laughs> what does she have? She has cocoa bean. She came in with pretty light blonde hair when she, when, when I first met her. Um, we went in and gave it some real depth for, for the dimension and, and the pop. Yeah, that's a big difference if she was a blondie. Now yeah. she has those great highlights she's in there. She's been getting compliments all week long about it. I think that she looks good with her dark hair. So you have to just add like a little bit of those golden colors in there. I've, yes, gold is, gold is the key to making a nice red or, or even nice deep brunette. That's such a good color and it's so shiny when it has those dark pieces in it too. Dark hair always reflects light better than light. Yeah, and blonde hair, we just don't have it that great, right? You spray shine. <laughs> Fake it with fresh That's a million dollar That's tip for us right. blondies out there today. Let's see one last look at all of our lovelies. All of this was done by Blaine today. Guys, you look fantastic. Blaine, always good to see you. And if you are ready for a new fall flavor, visit Blaine's website or for more information on how to make an appointment. And his website's blainescolor.com. Stay with us when we come back. We're getting connected with a cool new add on for the Xbox.